Yeah, no, I got into coaching because my dad was a coach, and I love the game of football. I saw the difference that my dad made in a lot of his players' lives, and um, and then I really enjoyed competing in the game of football. And I, I love chess, I love math, so I, I love the opportunity it forced me strategically to think through those things, but also more than anything, the reason I'm a football coach is because I love being on a team, and I love being on a team with young people where we can use the adversity that we see uh, every single week uh, as as a teaching tool, um, and we can talk about a lot of life lessons through the game of football um, and that's not just coach speak and our cliche that's just true and I think that's what I love about football I think that's why you can do your podcast and I can do mine and we have things like sports talk radio it's because football is such a common point for people to be able to sit back and you know I say it's always it's philosophy for non-philosophers and I actually teach a philosophy class at Hammond School um, and so people can extrapolate every life's meaning from a, a football game, you know, everyday life meaning from a football game. And we can meet on a common point about uh, big topics like morals and integrity and things like chemistry. And these are important, like big subjects that the game of football gives us all like this platform to talk about. Um, so it's really, really cool that we can do that publicly as a society, but as a football coach, be able to do that privately with, you know, 40 kids, 50 kids, 70 kids, whatever you have you, and uh, and be able to, you know, teach life, life lessons through that, I think is really, really rewarding for me personally. Um, so that's why I do it. And, you know, I've had a, we've had a good run at Hammond and we've had a great season this year. We're, we're 12 and 0 and playing for wow. the state championship next Saturday. So wow. coming Saturday at Benedict, right, right during the Gamecocks game. So I won't <laughs> be able to watch it. I'll have to DVR it and uh, watch it the next day. So hopefully I'll be in a really good mood when I watch it, but 